Hello everybody, welcome to Free March. We have just teleported as you saw in the last video from from Trillion to Free March. Um so we have to go down to where those two blue check marks are, which are very important check marks because of the fact that is that where is all the quests start out at. So we return these quests and basically this is where the whole free march zone starts is in Ark of the Ascended. And there's more people in this area than there is in the other areas for well, in various reasons. Such as the fact that this is the better area and usually people get through the starting zone pretty quick. It like in ten minutes sometimes, if they're really good. Um so basically we're just gonna go over here and what you gotta do is so you have to watch the message there's a little thing right here just click on it or right click insert the message listen to that woman if you're watching this and you survive through the time machine and survive the destruction of Talara yada yada survival means there's no hope for the future yada yada you have the power to change our fate the power to stop the guardians and when the time comes, we'll defeat Regulus himself. Hooray. You can and you will exceed, extended one. All hopes go with you. Okay, so, basically, that means, well, basically, it doesn't mean really much right now at this moment, but it does tell you some of the lore of the game. I'm just gonna grab this fair wind blade. Mm, it looks better than my balance shiv, so I will grab it. Except this next quest. So, you have to go to the top of the bridge at the Founder's Threshold, use the Absorption Rod on the Lord Runecliff, and then you have to speak with these three people for this other quest with... who is giving to us is Jillian Wake, who gave that quest to us. Okay. Now, I did equip that new weapon. So, first we're going to talk to these two people, then we'll go to that little... Uh, bridge and use the absorption rod so we'll speak with those people first and also grab that quest that is sitting right there in front of our faces so I don't know what you guys think about this game so far but I think it's pretty good um, you know it's there, really I haven't seen anything wrong with the game at all like it's basically flawless right now I have oh and we have to talk with more people now that this guy just gave it to us so Anyway, um, I really see no flaws with this game so far, even in the beta. So, you know, it's, it's, I think once it releases, um, it'll be like, no flaws, like, perfect, you know, everything will be worked out, not like some games, where it's like, oh, the beta's per, you know, beta's good, and then a problem comes along, and then they have to patch it, and then they have to do it again, and again, and again, and again, and again. So anyway, um, that's just what I'm thinking about it. Um, really, it really doesn't make a difference, but, you know, anyway, so we go to that Jillian Wake person again, turn in that quest, because we're done it, <laughs> 330 XP, it's, that's meh, anyway, um, basically that's, so we're gonna go and do the rest of those quests. We have to speak to Liana Spate and Tasm Siza. And then, but we also have to use that absorption rod on that guy up on the bridge. Uh, sorry. On Lord Rune Cliff. Clift. Clift. With a T at the end, sorry. Anyway. So, you know, we'll head up. Gotta find my damn way. Hell is this place? I think we. Ah, oh, there's some bad guys over here. I wonder. Don't have to t attack any of those. There's a rift over there. Uh, maybe we go up this hill. No, we probably. Yeah, yeah, we go up this hill right here. And then you know we probably just have to. You, know, you have to jump onto that hill. Jump. And jump. Turn yourself. And get on your way. So, just, that guy's funny. He's dressed in a robe. He looks funny. Anyway. Ooh, shiny. 
Oh, there's lots of fiery balls of death firing down at us. Oh, and then they're firing stuff back. So it's like a fireworks show almost, folks. And I, if you know me, I love my fireworks. I also like another type of fireworks, but I'm not going to get into that. Anyway, so... Here we go on our adventure into the bridge of hell. I like to call it the bridge of hell because it is. Anyway, so you speak to that person. Um, and I don't know why those things are sparkling, but anyway, back there. Those, like, cannons that almost look like uh, one of those old record player um, phones that, like, blast the music out. Alright, speak to this dumb guy right here. He's a little fat on the fat side. Puffy Marshmallow Man. Okay. So, basically what we gotta do is use the absorption rod on Learn Runecliff. And where is that silly guy? That's an own there. Is that him? That is him. That is Lord Runecliff. Okay. He's right behind me and I don't know why I'm walking around. Mm, there we go. Ta-da! Done. Okay. Now we go back to this lady here. Big boobs, too. Anyway. Um, so you have to... Oh, those are what we have to do. Okay. Anyway. So, down at the beach, we have to use the damaged cannons to shoot stuff at stuff. And then that quest returned in. Back at Ark of the Ascended. Do-do-do. So, here we go. Down to the beach. For a nice day on the sunny beaches of Regent's Cove. Click on those there. Mm, get those nice and primed. Okay, we just shot one of those. Didn't get a shot of where it goes, but anyway. That's a broken one. Here we go. Now, let's see what this does. Okay, I guess it blows up those people that come out of the boats. There, see those red guys that are walking up toward the shore? That's what those cannons are for. Die, bastards, die. Hooray, we're both done all the quests, so now we have to go back to Ark of the Ascended and return both of those quests. Whoopty freaking do. God, I don't sound so enthusiastic this morning. It's probably because I'm tired. It's probably because I'm tired because the fact that it's only, uh... As the fact it's only 8.22 a.m. where I am, and that's pretty, uh... It's not early. I woke up at, what, I think 5.30 this morning because I couldn't sleep, so... I've been awake for three hours, basically, and I'm tired, but not tired enough to not make a video. So, I'm making these videos for you guys, because you guys deserve it, and the reason why I'm staying, you know, awake f to do these videos is because I believe that if I don't, you guys will get mad and wonder where all the videos are. Hooray, quest complete. Okay, go to this. Word in Centurion. Oh, sorry, wrong person. Fair and notes. Yeah. Oh, I leveled up. Okay, she has a quest. It's called I'm an Old Soul. Well, that doesn't sound very exciting. Anyway, we have to talk to this captive over here. Endless court captive, I might add. Ew, what is it you want with me? Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Click that button. Okay. Tell him... You read that. Blah blah blah. <laughs> just, just, uh, just tell Regulus I'll be coming for him. Find your greatness. Hooray! All right, that was an easy quest, mind you. I'll probably get a lot of XP for it, because <laughs> games are just like, uh, yeah, I'll get 600 XP. That's a lot of XP just to walk one way and walk back. 